employee of the company that ran Mrs. Clinton's private email server used a program called BleachBit to delete files. The FBI concluded that Mrs. Clinton was unaware of the deletions. It was Bill Clinton, Mrs. Clinton's husband, who had a conversation with Loretta Lynch, who was serving as attorney general, on Ms. Lynch's plane, leading her to recuse herself in the email case involving Mrs. Clinton. The complaints about Mrs. Clinton came after a series of morning tweets in which Mr. Trump mocked federal investigators, saying they made up a phony collusion with the Russian story amid new reports that Robert S. Mueller III, the special counsel, is looking into whether Mr. Trump tried to obstruct justice in the case. They made up a phony collusion with the Russian story, found zero proof, so now they go for obstruction of justice on the phony story. Nice, Mr. Trump tweeted just before 7 a.m. In a later tweet, the president once again called the Russia investigation a witch hunt and called the people leading it's very bad, apparently a reference to Mr. Mueller and others at the FBI. Mr. Mueller has requested interviews with three current or former senior intelligence officials, according to a person briefed on the investigation. The move suggests he is examining whether the president sought their help in trying to get James B. Comey, the former FBI director, to end an investigation into Michael T. Flynn, the former national security advisor. The special counsel is also seeking documents from the National Security Agency relating to the intelligence agency's interactions with the White House on the Russia investigation. Together, the requests from Mr. Mueller indicate new scrutiny on whether the president tried to influence the Russia investigation through conversations he had with Mr. Comey, whom he ultimately fired, or with other officials. That would make Mr. Trump a subject of a sprawling inquiry that he has repeatedly said has no merit. During a Rose Garden news conference last Friday, the president insisted that Mr. Comey was a leaker